guys, so today I'm here at Cavalier Ranch with Ernesto Fecino or Fefe. And we're gonna talk a little bit about helmets because there's a few different ones. There's some really cool ones like these and we've seen some of the big pros such as Facundo Pieres wearing Cavalier helmets. Yeah. So I wanna know a bit more about how, like the different ones, how do you get a helmet to look this cool? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And uh, yeah, so tell me. Uh, we basi basically have two types of, he of helmets. We have like the glass fiber ones, that they are like the most common ones. We make the carbon fiber ones on the inside. Uh -huh. It's a much better helmet, more resistant and much lighter ones. And then about this type of helmets, we, we, we found out that people wanted something different. Yeah, looks good. <laughs> uh, what we do basically is we take a photo in, in high definition and then we grab a white cloth and we print it and then you have whatever you want on your helmet. It's pretty cool. Yeah. The thing with, with the visor is that it has to be soft, never hard. So if you, if you do like this, you're going to notice that the visor starts moving a bit mm -hmm. because it's cardboard. It's one of the only materials that when you hit the floor, you bend and go all, o all over again to its place. So if you fall and the visor breaks, it's okay. Yeah. And you will change it. Tell me the story of Cavalier. How did it start? Who started it? Who had the idea that we're going to start making helmets now? Uh, we started about 2010. How do you say 2010? 2010. Seven years ago right now. So yeah. <laughs> Seven years ago uh, with Nicolás Fernández Llanos, mm -hmm. my partner, and Daniela Fenoglio, the other partner. And we started making bags and mallet bags. That the, was the first product we take. They were not good. <laughs> no, we didn't like it too much. you're honest. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to learn from your mistakes. They were nice so, yeah. and everything, but we make like, I don't know, 200 bags and 200 mallet bags, too much for starting. <laughs> and then we noticed that uh, every player has had like similar helmets. They were blue, white, and the most uh, rare one was a red one. And we say, why, why we don't do a, like a different helmet? Giving the, the customer some options that wasn't available on the market. The polo market is very traditional. And Anything you take out of the box is like uh, uh, it notices very fast. Mm. So we try to do that, and we continue doing that with every yeah. product we, we take away. So. Well, excellent! I think you guys are doing a great job, Thank and you. these helmets are very nice and pretty, and also functional. So that's yeah, sure. That's important. Well, thank you very much no, for this you. interview and I look forward to seeing what else Cavalier is going to come for sure, up with. For sure. I've seen some new products around, so yeah. let's go and have a look at <laughs>